Hi, I'm Amr, one of the co-founders of Circular, and today I want to show you exactly what you can expect when you receive your Circular Ring 2. So once you receive it, you connect it to the Circular app, which you can download on Apple and Android. Uh, this is what you get. Let me get through the section very quickly with you. The first thing you see are two different types of feeds. The first one just sums up all of your metrics, um, also looks at your chronotype to give you the best time to be productive, to work, to take coffee, etc., but also sums up all of your biometrics. The second feed is to us one of the most important ones. It's called Kira. Kira is an AI agent that will sum up all of your biometrics and gives you personal recommendations on everything it tracks. So it's super personal and examples of recommendations can go from uh, how to improve your sleep to uh, supplements to take to even being able to predict when you'll get sick before getting the first symptoms. It can go really in depth. Now, to go through all the different circles, we need to go what we call over the different circles. A circle is a different feature in Circular. There will be 13 at launch. So in June, when you receive your ring, there will be 13. The first one is Alarm Clock. Alarm Clock gives you a score based on your wake up and how and when and in which stages of sleep you woke up in. The second one is Sleep Analysis. It gives you what we call a sleep quality score. And we track more than 140 metrics every two minutes. So it's based on a lot of data, but I'm not going to go through all of it now. The contributors to their score are displayed here. You can click on them if you want to see the details of those. And you can also see all the details of each statistic here in the different graphs. So your sleep stages, your blood oxygenation during the night, your heart rate, your HRV, etc. The third circle is energy analysis. It's very similar in how it's displayed to sleep analysis, but this one looks at how you woke up, your sleep over the past couple of days, your recovery, your activity intensities, and of course gives you all the stats like your steps, um, your calories, your distance, etc. The fourth one is also a score. It's called the stress score, the stress levels. Uh, this one looks at how relaxed or overwhelmed you are in the day and also gives you predictions over the next couple of hours. Finally, we have here uh, breathing uh, exercises, which are a number of guided breathing exercises we've been developing over the past years. Uh, there are a number of them uh, to improve your sleep, to relieve your stress, uh, to enhance creativity. There are a lot, and you can also create your own custom exercise. Then we have live measurements. Live measurements is if you want to see and display live the data coming out of your ring. So you will see your HRV, your blood oxygenation, uh, your HR max, and of course your heart rate live straight on your app. Then we have medication reminder. Medication reminder is pretty self-explanatory, but you can create schedules of when and to take doses of a certain medication and the phone will remind you of when to take them. Very similar to it, to get notifications on vitals alerts, this circle is a circle in which you can set up um, triggers or thresholds under or, un or above which uh, the app will notify you of if your heart rate or SPO2 gets to above or under that th certain threshold. Next you have sports sessions. Sports sessions is very different from energy analysis. It really looks at uh, a specific sports session that you're launching uh, to generate a report on your heart rate, on your GPS and the route you took if you went for a run during your sports session. And you can also set goals in order to uh, be able to crush them during the week. So for example here, a running session, uh, you will have your GPS route, you will have your heart rate during your activities. Then you have advanced analytics, one of our latest circles. This one is for those who want to correlate data points between them. So for example, I can stack uh, my sleep stats, my temperature, my calories, and see how these data points might correlate between each, each other. So if one dips, maybe the other one will not, uh, and you can make your own conclusions. Note also that this takes into account the note system, which is pretty powerful in Circular. So if you head to your calendar, you can add notes for things that Circular doesn't track. But also if you want to add any types of notes, there are a number of notes you can add. And these notes will be reflected in every part of the app, in the sleep graph, the energy graphs, but most importantly, in Kira. She will take into account these notes to make even more personal recommendations. Next, we have coherence. Coherence is a breathing exercise that um, not a lot of people know, but is very powerful. A lot of athletes and high-level execs use it to be in what we call a flow state. It just takes two minutes and you can get in this state. And finally, this is the only for now um, feature that takes advantage of the new ECG on the Circular 2. It's arrhythmia detection. 
arrhythmia detection uh, is just a 30 seconds recording. You just need to touch your ring like this with the finger from your other hand and it will take a measurement. So the reports of that measurement can be found here. You have all of the history of those measurements. For example, here took a, um, a measurement. You can see the ECG trace and you can see whether or not, and hopefully for you, you're in a sinus rhythm or if you have AFib, tachycardia or bradycardia. And just to give you an example, Stay still during the measurement, of course, movement is the biggest enemy for this type of measurement. And here you have your ECG trace. It's a 40 seconds measurement, and don't forget that you can share these reports with your doctor to see if there's anything wrong or not with your heart rhythm. Finally, the 13th circle will, if not be available at launch, maybe a little bit afterwards with um, app updates. So there's nothing to change, no new ring to buy. Uh, these will be women's health, so prediction over women's um, periods, but also fertility windows. And later down the road this year, um, most probably we're going to be releasing blood pressure and further down the road again, glucose monitoring. But lastly, I want to say that there are a number of other features inside the Circular app that are already available. You have leaderboards to compare to the community. Chronotype is very powerful. You have a coin system, as in you can gain coins every day based on your scores, which will be useful later down the road when you have uh, different things you can unlock with the coins. So a lot to explore. Have fun with the ring, and I hope you like it.